Thank you. The bleeding is that. How did you? It's nothing. It's just a scratch. Dr. Lecter, whose head is in that bottle? Why don't you ask me about Buffalo Bill? Well, do you know something about him? I might if I saw the case file. You could get that for me. Well, why don't we talk about Miss Moffat? You wanted me to find him. His real name is Benjamin Raspell, a former patient of mine whose romantic attachments ran to, shall we say, the exotic. I did not kill him, I assure you, merely tucked him away very much as I found him after he'd missed three appointments. But if you didn't kill him, then who did, sir? Who can say? Best thing for him, really. His therapy was going nowhere. His dress, uh, makeup. Raspo was a transvestite? In life? Oh, no. Garden variety manic depressive. Tedious. Very tedious. No, no, I just think of him as a kind of experiment. A fledgling killer's first effort at transformation. How did you feel when you saw him, Clarice? Scared at first, then. Exhilarated. Jack Crawford is helping your career, isn't he? Apparently, he likes you, and you like him, too. I never thought about it. Do you think Jack Crawford wants you sexually? True, he is much older, but do you think he visualizes scenarios, exchanges, fucking you? That doesn't interest me, Doctor. Frankly, it's, it's the sort of thing that Miggs would say. Not anymore. Thank you, Barney. What happened to your drawings? Punishment, you see, for Migs. Just like that gospel program. When you leave, they'll turn the volume way up. Dr. Chilton does enjoy his petty torments. Did you mean by transformation, Doctor? I've been in this room for eight years now, Clarice. I know they will never, ever let me out while I'm alive. What I want is a view. I want a window where I can see a tree or even water. I want to be in a federal institution far away from Dr. Chilton. What did you mean by fledgling killer? Are you saying that he's killed again? I'm offering you a psychological profile in Buffalo Bill based on the case evidence. I'll help you catch him, Clary. You know who he is, don't you? Tell me who decapitated your patient, Doctor. All good things to those who wait. I've waited, Clary, but how long can you and old Jackie boy wait? Our little Billy must already be searching for that next special lady. 